42 of Kansas. Tries the option towards the boundary, and it's well read. Utilizing all of his talents to uh, help us with his binoculars. With those numerals, that pass is incomplete in his career. And that allows Tyrone Swoops, who is an outstanding athlete, to play this position, and Gray takes it again. And we're up this Texas offense. Right up the gut on third and one. The lone setback. Run out of the power. Ooh, deep five-step drop. And now some pressure coming, and Swoops is in trouble. Taken out of bottom of your screen. Second and 18 now. 19 will call it officially. There's the athletic ability of Swoops. He saw a lot of green. Out of the shotgun, Swoops. Going that corner route. To Malcolm Brown back in the game. They fake it to him. And that one is hauled in. He's in the slot to the top of your screen. Brown and Gray are the setbacks. Oh, they run a chicanery. Coming back the other way to Foreman. Just as we identify him, he fumbles the football. But fortunately, the defensive coordinator happy. Gray and Delatore in the backfield. And it's Gray burrowing ahead for two mm -hmm. down to about. In this case, looks like they're going to run it Movement at the two-yard line. Kansas believes they've got the ball, and they do. Tyrone Swoops turns it over. That looked hurried from the get-go, and it's uh, Ben Heaney. They busted it up. I don't think he ever got the ball off the snap. Sw Timeout. That's Harris in motion. And with the wide receiver screen, and Shipley reels it in. In Swoops running option to Malcolm Brown, who finds the edge and gets it will be Brown. Good cutback inside the five and down. Actually marked it at the one-yard line. That late surge from Brown. Play fake two this time. A wide open receiver in the end zone. Jonathan Gray dotting it. Right up the gut for two yards, and that's it. Comes into play. Second down and eight. And they go with Jonathan Gray. A yard back when I was a youngster. Malcolm Brown will take it, running towards the boundary. Jake Lee's that ended with no score. Play clock winding down. They go play action here. Swoops looking long for Marcus Johnson, and he overthrows it. And Tyrone Swoops. Second down and ten. Looking for Shipley, incomplete. This is incomplete. Pressure coming. And uh, Swoops gets beyond contain again. And manages the 31. Jonathan Gray. Second and five. Nothing doing this time, though. Tevin Shaw loved the tight end in these circumstances in the past. And it is a bootleg. Nice call by Brady Quinn. Does he get in? He does. Touchdown, Texas. And why would you start thinking about anything other than Jackson Shipley in that situation? We had no chance of coming up to get the quarterback. There's another throw in, intended for... Pressure coming, and that pass is caught by Brown. But he is quickly knocked out of bounds. Boy, when he breaks contain, this is where he becomes dangerous. Although this time, he just gets rid of it. And Brown in the backfield. Texas takes over at the 20. Quick slant to Shipley. And the fifth all time. Decision by Brown to cut back in. Again with that blue leg action, action rolling left and uh, dumping it away. In this case, Heaney is the stand-up defensive end. They're starting to move him around a bit, and Jake Love comes all the way from the other linebacker spot just to make sure. That uh, 
He was not called for either pass interference offensively or the face mask. Jonathan Gray takes it out beyond the 10 yard three. It's Jonathan Gray. He fumbled it. The Jayhawks look to be in position for it, but did they come away with it? Look at that. That was a good, good tackle and strip, but Gray was so quick. He knew right away and he grabbed it. Just uh, on first down, Gray again. You know, Jonathan. Over the option, swoops, spun down. In trouble and sacked back at the nine yard line. I'd receive her a chance. Nothing doing this time. Stopped at the line of scrimmage is Malcolm Brown. Your screen. Throws underneath, and that is to number 83, Foreman, who had that big reverse earlier in the game. That's... They go bootleg. Swoops trying to get to the edge. He's in trouble. Run out back at midfield. Michael Reynolds, great. And they're doing everything in their power to help the young man. Just not his day. Swoops his pass. Too strong for Jackson. Second down and 10. And here's Malcolm Brown looking to get to the edge, and he stopped. This Jayhawks defense has answered the bell every time. Third down and 12. Looking for Shipley. He's got it. Stopped at the 27 yard line. Out of the shotgun and the end zone. That pass is caught right to Harris. Now, that is a big first down for Texas. Now they can reel, which they've had a lot of today and not been able to take advantage of it. Here's that naked boot action again. This time the pass is caught to Jeff Swain, number 82. And the tight end lumbers pass ahead, complete. 10. Here comes a blitz from the inside. He has to dump it. I've been a proponent pass of Charlie's complete. a long time. He got disciplined. Third and 10. Swoops. Well, there's a situation where Harris did come back a little. Pass was incomplete. Well, Swoops just threw that one in the dirt for Mal the total number they had all of 2013. Malcolm Brown again for about a yard, and that's all. Harris again along the sidelines on the quick out. PLA loss. Thought there might be some rust after the time off. That fade pattern is caught. For a touchdown, Marcus Johnson. They have to make the eight-yard line for first down. Johnson gets it again. He just had a touchdown taken away from him. I think he really wants to get back in. Late October, early November with the talent that they have. That's a rifle shot to Harris. Did he get in? Touchdown.